Okay, here's my uh, demonstration on how to install the uh, tape for the window inserts. It's important that you use the tape with the brown backing, which is the, uh, the specialty tape that um, I had created just, had created just for, uh, just for this. And uh, it's pretty simple. All you gotta do is peel the back off of the tape, and then you wanna position it between the screen and the zipper here as much as you can, because you want to have the screen uh, open so you can see through it, and it provides a surface, a nice surface for the uh, specialty glue to, uh, to stick to on this. And then it uh, kind of puts it out of your way too, so you can't tell from the outside you get your inserts in, <laughs> get your windows inserts in, um, that you've even uh, got this there. So it, uh, it sticks nicely out of the way. Uh, plus, it is um, out of the way for the zipper too. So you can zipper this up and keep the inserts in. Inserts. Window inserts in. Uh, and then on the end window, uh, on ours, you have a, a zip out for the screen as well. And it doesn't get in the way of that. So you can still safely get out of the camper that way. Um, so just to show you real quick, uh, I'm gonna apply it to ours. I haven't done the rear side window uh, yet, so we'll stick this baby on there so you can get an idea. She is sticky. Like I said, we had we had this uh, specially created uh, for us uh, by a company because I couldn't I couldn't find any other um, hook and loop that would stick to this tent material. Right. So apply it like this. Press it right here. It doesn't have to be perfect, but as best as you can, get it in that sweet spot here. Make sure that is peeled out of the way as you insert it. It's all straight. We go right in there. Turn that out of the way. Right. Channel there. Push. Then, as you insert it, it's you need to push, push, push all the way, and you should have some. Left over here. I tried to cut it long uh, for folks. And I'll cut off that end in a second. But um, you want to make sure that you deliberately press this in there, right? So you want to get the glue in the fibers of the tent. Take make sure it's got good adhesion. And then once you finish that, you want to let this tape sit for at least 24 hours. That gives it time to cure. So you've got a good bond on the tape and the tent. Um, that's about it for this. Do the same thing for this. For this, you don't do it for the bottom, um, but for the three other sides, you do. And then after 24 hours of cure, you can stick your window insert, which you already have uh, the Velcro on that, to this, and you're good to go. Then you can leave the inserts in there. Um, as long as you want, you can fold up the tin in. It's all uh, flexible, foldable, and it's probably the, the best and easiest place to store them is in your, uh, your, your tent window area here. Just zip them up uh, and keep them in there, and then you just pull it out whenever you want. The airflow, like today, it's uh, nice, 65, something like that. It's on a day like today and it's not raining. It'd be great to have them open. All you gotta do is you know pull the inserts off, sit them down, and you can enjoy the uh, the breeze, nature, but not, not so much nature here, but like uh, nature when you guys go camping. And then put the inserts back in, and then you can leave your windows down. And if it rains, you're good to go. If it gets hot or cold outside, you can turn on the heater AC. Uh, you're still good to go. And then um, if you want any privacy, you can zip these up. And then when you get ready to go, zip them up. Other than that, uh, we just leave them in. So. Um, that's about it. It's all pretty simple. You wanna make sure when you're putting on the uh, hook and loop to an in window unit, you secure it to this part and not that part. That way you can uh, put the inserts in when the screen is in there and it will stick this strip here, but then part of it will be sticking to the, uh, to the screen there. But that's all right. That's, that's the way it should be. 
And that way, if you need to, you can unzip the window uh, quickly, even with the insert in, and get out. It will, it will work great for you. And you can also pull out the insert uh, and the screen will still be there. So that's the only difference between the end window and any of the side windows because this unzip unzips for an emergency exit. Uh, but like I said, if you install it this way, which is the way you should install it, um, it'll work just like the side windows and will still allow you to So if you, if you choose to put the uh, tabs on the bottom of your inserts to uh, keep the bottom from pushing in, if, like if you have a high wind, uh, they go in thirds like this. So the end window, you'll have uh, two tabs. So they go third the other way over. And then on the side windows, you just need to put uh, one in the center and uh, that should hold you pretty good.